Yeah, allow me to introduce myself. I am a 35 year old Silius Ivan Charles, and I live in a small island in the Caribbean called the Commonwealth of Dominica. And I'm just using my YouTube channel to basically document my life, you know, living as an educated bum. Living as an educated bum in Dominica. Yeah. So, I'm just basically going to document everything about my my situation, the way I'm living right now in Dominica. Yeah. Well, I do have a degree, a bachelor's degree in environmental engineering. I graduated in, um, I graduated? 2010. I graduated when I was 26. And uh, so far it's been, and I, I did studies in Mexico so far since I came back to Dominica. I haven't gotten any steady em um, employment for the past 10 years. Uh, currently, I'm a homeless person. You know, this is this is the beach. It's basically my kitchen. You know, and um, I'm just making this video really to to let to, to just being homeless is a, is a challenge. Yeah, this is why I cook my food. Yeah, this is why I cook my food right now. I'm in this. This thing up there. Right. Yeah, this is why I can't cook my food right there. Because I can't afford. I can't afford gas right now. Yeah, so being homeless is very dangerous. I don't like it. You have to sleep on the floor, on the concrete, on the floor. You know, you get stung by, by centipedes, scorpions, you know, or the stinging insects. Or the stinging insects, etc. Yeah, and um, the thing about being homeless is really dangerous. You know that you're sleeping, and um, somebody could do you something. So I feel like anything could happen to me. So I'm just making this video to, to, to if ever I'm, I'm dead, I'm not here tomorrow. People could always look at me and see see to know my situation forever as long as i basically don't delete my youtube account and don't remove the videos so yeah i got short i'm a i'm actually i'm a below the knee and knee amputee yeah i got prosthetic leg i got shot in um got back when i was like it's 30 and they had to cut my leg below my 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 my, my knee and he, yeah, I just got shot over jealous reasons, like, you know, somebody just, when you know somebody do, does, you, does you something bad just to hold you back in life, you know, and uh, people run you out on the street, they don't want you in the, hall, in the house and stuff like that, so. Yeah, this is just to, 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 to talk about it, yeah. yeah, so, yeah, so. Yeah, so I was saying being homeless is, is something that is really, it's really, really dangerous. Yeah. I just want, if anything happens to me, you know, I just want the world to know, you know my situation here. Yeah. So this little area is called Lagoon Bay. This This is where I was raised. You know, everybody around here is against me, you know, against me. Ever since I came back from studies, uh, I mentioned here yeah, my degrees in environment and engineering. Yeah, and, um, you know why? Since I had work, but I'll just be making making these these videos, you know, to, to to talk, to show 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 you how. Okay, so this is basically how I, I start off in the morning. I start in the morning. I make something here to eat on wood fire. You know, I call it pieces of trash and stuff like that. And, um, rock trash and stuff like that. And, yeah, pieces of wood and stuff on the beach to carry around to make my food. 
I can cook when the hood cook although it is burning wood every day really this is a significant amount of carbon into the atmosphere but <laughs> at least I get at least you get you, you get an opportunity to clean the beach you know from pieces of sticks wood wood and stuff like that to keep clean yeah, well, this is the environment, really the environmental environment work I've, I've, I've really, the most steady environment work I've been, been, been living I've been on, on, on this beach there for, for quite a while now. I've been on this beach here for, cooking on this beach here for about three years. And for about three years, the passage of Hurricane Maria made it worse. Yeah, I lived in my house, got dilapidated, like destroyed. The roof came off and I had to put in the roof at uh, the top and stuff like that. On the top of the house, galvanized. You know, there were mosquitoes in there. Rats used to bite, bite my foot. And I own my I only have one leg. The one foot and rats used to bite that. Yeah. Really, 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 really hard. So I will record. I record, I record stuff. You know, as I go along to this, you know, let you know how it is every day in the life of an educated bum, <laughs> living as an educated bum, yeah. living as an educated bum in Dominica, yeah, the corner for Dominica, yeah. Uh, so I basically show you where I cook my food, you know. This is where I shower. Go to the, 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 this, this, this is the shower. I'm going to show you every, everything, man. Yeah, for now. <laughs>